Oh, that water is cold. If you watched my previous video, then you already know what this is, and I'm not going to go into details. So, one of my girlfriends was asking me to do a tea with Lamika video about my upcoming birthday. My birthday is in June, June 11th, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Why did I say to be honest? Oh my God, I don't know. Anyway, yes, yeah, June 11th, um, 1976. So now you know my age. Um, and she wanted to know what I had planned for my upcoming birthday. And to be honest with you, I don't know what is planned. I don't know what I'm going to do. There's a scrapbook expo that weekend. Uh, a few movies are coming out that weekend that I want to see. I think only one movie, actually. Um, but I don't know what I want to do. Um, when I've always... Well, I told my husband, I think he's trying to surprise me. But I had told him about my childhood, and um, I know people, a lot of people don't know this, only people that are personal know this about me, but I was raised Jehovah's Witness, and when you're raised Jehovah's Witness, you don't have birthdays, you don't celebrate birthdays, you don't celebrate Christmas, Halloween, you don't do any of that stuff. And when you are a young kid... Growing up like that, it is very hard on you when other kids at school are celebrating things. You know, they're having fun for Valentine's Day. They're able to, you know, um, give each other the little Valentine card things or whatever that you make. Uh, Christmas time, your cousins are opening presents and you're not um or uh, you see other you know kids getting new things and you didn't or if you are going to celebrate something you don't celebrate it the day of you may celebrate it the day after or your stuff is just not in the in wrapped in anything it's just laying there so yeah my 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 childhood so I never celebrated my birthday growing up. I never had a surprise birthday party. Nothing that I can remember. I mean, if it happened when I was a baby baby, maybe. But nothing as far back as I can remember ever being surprised. And I told my husband, um, I'm on, I just feel like I want to cry about this because it really is sad to me. But I told my husband, I said, you know, that's the one thing I've always wanted was a group of friends to surprise me for once. You know, sorry, guys. I don't even know why I'm talking about this. But it's a sad situation because I'm a grown woman. I've never been surprised for my birthday. Usually, I know what's going to happen. Usually, I know um, what's coming. Usually, I just know everything because more than likely, I'm the person that's doing it. But I have never, ever in my life had the element of surprise for myself. Because usually I can, I, I, I'm the person behind it or I either find out because somebody can't hold water. They can't keep it, keep it a secret, you know. Sorry. So, when it comes to birthdays, it's very, it's very... It's almost sad for me because that's just the one thing I want. I have always wanted, you know. I'm not trying to I'm not trying to make myself look better than anybody or boost myself. But when it comes to me making sure that other people are happy, I make damn sure they're happy for their birthday. If I have anything to do with it. I make sure that I can send someone a card for their birthday. I may be late. I'm not going to lie to you. Especially if I done forgot about it. I got other things going on. I may be late. But I certainly, 
certainly try to make sure people are happy for their birthday. If I want to surprise them, I make sure I surprise them. They don't know what's coming and I don't tell anyone else about it. But I have never had that happen to me. I always know what's when something's coming. And for once in my life, I would love it if somebody would just surprise me. Come over out the blue, you know, or just, I don't know. I just would love to be surprised on my birthday. And I've, I've never had that. I, I've never had a surprise party for me, uh, for myself, you know, or anybody throw me one. Anybody say, you know what, let's get together and throw me a surprise birthday party. And, you know, I show up and I'm, I, I really am surprised because I didn't know people were, you know, doing it for me so it's um a little sad but over the years i have learned to cope with and get over it um am i a i know the the neck i know someone will probably wonder and ask do i still practice being a jehovah's witness no i do not um i honestly don't agree with what they say me and my sister, uh, pretty much, we sort of had a fall. Well, we didn't have a falling out, but we were at odds about some things because of the guy she's about to marry. Doesn't believe in, you know, celebrating Halloween. Doesn't believe in, you know, uh, Christmas. I guess he called himself trying to be a Muslim all, all of a sudden, you know. Who knows? But, um, and no shade to Muslims. But, I told her, I said, you know, you know how our childhood was. And all, all this time, your daughter has been able to celebrate all of these holidays. And now all of a sudden, you want to take that away from her. I think that's kind of wrong. That's kind of cruel. I mean, you know, that's not cool at all. I would never do that because, see, a child doesn't know. All they know is they see their friends having fun and getting stuff, and then they over here like, well, what what, what do I do? You know, so it's not fun. It, it, it's not fun at all. And I just don't, I don't think that uh, it's just something that I agree with, you know. I don't, no, I don't go to church. I'm, I'm, I, I don't go to church at all, but I do want to start going to church. Um... And I've spoken about that before, and it, I'm not going to go into details now, but I, I don't want to be associated with the Kingdom Hall of Jehovah's Witnesses. I have family that are um, Jehovah's Witnesses, and I still speak to them, and I still love them, but it's just not for me because I don't agree with the stuff that they talk about. You know, um, not to the point where I got to get all into detail. I just don't agree with that aspect of, aspect of it, you know. I just feel like a child should be a child. Let them enjoy. Like I told my sister, who cares about Halloween supposed to be something for the devil? It's just simply kids wanting to go out, dress up for a night, and get some freaking candy. If you have to go into details about every single thing in the um, United States as far as why people celebrate it, you don't really have a life. It's not that serious. You live life once. Enjoy it. That's how I see it. So that's, um, that's about my birthday. So, I don't know. If I have anyone on my video channel that's a Jehovah Witness, I'm sorry if I offend you. Um, feel free to unsubscribe, I guess. But I'm just telling you how I feel. And that is my tea for Lamika for today. Um, this will be posted probably Thursday. Talk to you guys later. Bye.